This year's Peace Prize went to uh, Maria Ressa, a journalist in the Philippines, and Dmitry Muratov, a journalist in Russia. They have received the prize because, as journalists, they have, in fact, defended the freedom of information and the freedom of expression. And this is very important in the world today, that we have a fact-based information platform in our societies, because this contributes to democracy and peace. Let me first tell you about Maria Ressa. Uh, she has a long career as a journalist, but she has founded a media platform in the Philippines called Rapla as a reaction to um, one-sided um, information influence in the Philippines. And it has cost her um, immensely. She has been criminally prosecuted, she has been threatened on her life, and she is an iconic grand lady of journalism and an enormously courageous person. Dmitry Muratov is also a journalist. First and foremost, he has been the founder and the editor of the newspaper Novaya Gazeta. The journalists of Novaya Gazeta are listened to all over Russia and throughout the world because they report on and comment on issues that are not stories that are not told in the more accepted state-run Russian media. It's about warfare, corruption, and all kinds of issues where they have challenged the official truths. This has come at an enormous price for the newspaper. Six of its journalists have in fact been killed and Dmitry Muratov has dedicated his prize to the memory of these journalists who worked for Novaya Gazeta. It is to the greatest benefit of mankind that we live in societies where truth is told. And what is truth? It is telling about conflicts, it's telling about what our leaders want to hide from us. It is bringing us the necessary facts. And these two journalists are fighting exactly for that, that we can have the facts that are necessary so we can understand the world, so people can make the right decisions. And uh, because democracy is a society where we don't have to fight with arms. We can fight with words. We are not necessarily in agreement, but that doesn't matter. We must not start armed conflicts because we are in disagreement. So democracy is good for peace.